Yeah, you have to redo this. Okay. So it's slowly, slightly picking it up, but that's weird. Do you guys hear it a little or no? Deleting it and just putting it back in, at least the video capture card is actually picking up something. Because I see it gauging, but it's like barely moving. No, without me moving around, the um the video capture device is um yeah, is moving. And then when I don't talk, it's still moving. Hey Tarzan, up and welcome back. Who is this? <laughs> oh my god. Just trying to um, figure this out, guys. See, like I see the mic picking it up. HDMI. Doesn't even have a color. I mean, uh, an optical. That is very interesting. Yeah, it's just um, the HDMI that powers the um, Ethernet and then two USBs on the back, one USB and one Type C on the front. So Come on. What is going on here? I had this working. Oh, there we go. Good grief. All right. So, before we get into full throttle, we have a PS5. Hey, Mudcat with the subscription. Thank you. Hey, Jesse. I see Patrick's in the chat. Mudcat, Miss Jesse Star. This is a beautiful box. Now, I did cut it a little bit just to get this thing 
Because this isn't why we're here. But it's here. And everybody else is doing one, so I figured I'd do one as well. Abbott, what's going on? Alright, so let's just... But I might have to move this camera up a little bit. No. All right. So giant white box. You can see the PlayStation symbol. I'm going to move this back down here real quick. This PlayStation 5 is just too big for life. <clears throat> So, off the top, we have a power cable, a quick start guide, a safety guide, oh, that, uh, HDMI, controller, uh, USB type C. So we can so power cable, uh, controller cable, HDMI, the Dual Sense uh, controller, which feels quite nice in the hand, I must say. I've never been a big fan of the PlayStation controllers, um, but this feels really, really nice. So I look forward to playing with that. Um, then we have the stand. I haven't decided how I'm going to display this thing yet, if it's going to be vertical or horizontal. Um, but that's the stand there. Um, goes vertical or horizontal. Let's get the. That's all the ex not really exciting stuff. Um. <clears throat> Comes with this really minimal recyclable packaging, which is quite nice. Oh, actually, so here's the PlayStation 5 controller. Here's the PlayStation 4 controller, just as a comparison. Um, so you can see they're fa it's fairly similar. Um, there's just some refinements um, that I, I've noticed almost immediately with this controller, which I'm already impressed with. Like this controller, I sort of hate. Um, but I'm, I'm liking what I'm feeling with this one. Toss that over there. And then, we got the beast. <clears throat> Get those cardboard out of the way. Okay. So, this is the front. 
So you've got a USB-A and a USB-C port. Uh, power. There's no. This is the all digital uh, version of the PlayStation 5, so there's no disc tray, obviously. And then. On the back, it's really quite simple. Power, HDMI, Ethernet, two USB ports, and uh, and then the stand can either go here or it uh, it just clips onto the back here, and then you can uh, position it horizontally. But I mean, it's it's really big. But yeah. So I will uh, set this up a little bit later. But, you know, let's see if we can. Yeah, that's what she said. Exactly. Let's see if we can. Get this stand going. I think I have my PlayStation set up right next to me, so I'll probably just replace that with this. And that just comes off. Um, hmm. Oh, like. So, is that right? Doesn't feel right. I guess it must be. Oh, there's. Oh, okay. So that just stays open. I wonder if... Huh, yeah. So the little tab thingy goes under here. And then... And then this just goes in like so. Oh, and then this clips in like that. Need a little... I have a screwdriver near me. I'm gonna go grab one. You can stare at that screw. Back in a second. Okay, so there. I think that's all she wrote. Hey, Misty, how's it going? Just uh, setting up my new PS5 here. Nice little reflection. That is not tight. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Let's see here. But the screw's in all the way, so I guess it will have to do. So, 
So it has the full stand. It just kind of wiggles a little bit, which is, I find a little strange. But what are you going to do? Pretty neat, though. I mean, as far as like a really simple design. It's quite nice. It's just gigantic. And this is cut out as well. So it's got a little bit there. All right, well, <clears throat> I'll probably do some PS5 streaming. Um, what's today? Thursday. Maybe on Saturday. And then Sunday will be our Lego uh, train as usual. Um... Unfortunately, I don't have a a 4K uh, output, so it won't necessarily do me any good there. But I will um, we'll uh, we'll play some Spider-Man or something. I'll get this set up um, tonight, and we'll get the. Uh, We'll get to full throttle, which should be ready to go. Uh, hmm. Oh, there we go. Perfect. All right, so, oh, you know what? Hang on one second here. Uh, sorry, guys. Let me just get this set up real quick. before we get on to full throttle. All right. So, how's everybody doing on this Thursday evening? Good, I hope. is working all right let's get into this game awesome habit i love to hear it okay so if you guys remember we um we jumped the gorge and now we are at uh corley motors um there's a few things that I remember that we can do here. Um, ultimately, we need to get into Corley Motors, which is a little bit 
um, of a puzzle in and of itself. And then there's some bunnies involved and some other stuff. I, I don't walk. So let's not go that way. Um... If I recall, we have to wait for them all to line up. No? Hmm. I'll beat it up later when I have more time. I know there's a specific area. It's sealed shut. It's sealed shut. But you have to kick. All right, let's uh, forget that for the moment. We'll go down here. I'm here for the shareholders' meeting. Mr. Ripperger has postponed the meeting until Mr. Corley's murderers are apprehended. All the shareholders were notified. Yeah. Well, I haven't checked my voicemail lately, Mac. Okay. So there's nothing I can do here. Souvenirs here! Oh, there we, we go. We got your hats. We got your pennants. Sure, sure. Take it for a spin. Just don't go out of range. We got it all right here. Official Corley Motors merchandise. Our bunnies come with batteries included. Looks like it's getting weak. Oh great, you killed the battery. Lovable, lovable little bunnies. <clears throat> what can I get you? Um... I'm looking for a good souvenir. Well. Good souvenirs is all I got. What can I fix you up with? Something small, furry, and yellow. Sorry, this is the only set of teeth I got. <laughs> Dang, there goes another one. Bunnies, and plenty of them. You want bunnies? I got your bunnies. How much you got on you? Um, can I just take them out for a test drive? I think you may not be ready for the kind of commitment that comes with a Corley Bunny value pack. Sorry, son. How about that little car there? It's small, but it's not cheap, my friend. You better just take it for a test drive to make sure. Actually, let me think about it. He who hesitates, and his kids hate him. Thanks for the warning. Some solid advice there. Seen any vultures around here? Nah, we don't have much of a vulture problem here, even though their hideout is right up the road. They stay pretty much locked up in there. Not very social. Better let you get back to work. All right, matey. All right. We got your t-shirts here. It's out of juice. All sizes and colors. Oh. Do we steal the batteries from the money? It's out of juice. Fill our handy beverage hats with your drink of choice. All right, let's see the cash, amigo. I'll owe you. No bucks, no yucks, compadre. Hmm. Are uh, you? Those weapons were out of weight. Souvenirs to remind you of your special Smashatorium adventure. It's the exit. It only spins one way, and it's the wrong way. I'm not going in there. They all think I killed their beloved leader. So we need batteries for the Buy your kids money so they'll shut up on the long drive home. And we need... Don't be a cheap jerk. Buy something. We 
Let's see here. Let's go up the road. Pretty sure I need the bunnies for this too, but let's see how we how well we do. There's the vultures hideout on the other side of this field. I've heard a lot about the vultures. And I guess it's all true. Okay, so we can't go there. Definitely a specific spot to kick it. Question is, where is that spot? So let's just start kicking the wall. There we go. I really need batteries. Where am I going to find battery? Let me in. Beat it. Jerk. If we don't got it, then it stinks. <laughs> Kinda cute. For a car, that is. Pat! Uh. You just can't get this stuff anywhere else, folks. <clears throat> what can I get you? Need Why all the lights batteries, down here? Bud. We got a demolition derby tonight. First prize is a vintage curly hardtail. Completely restored by the old man himself. Yep. Need some batteries. I'm looking for a good souvenir. Well, good souvenirs is all I got. What can I fix you up with? Those uh, shirts come in extra, extra large. Eh. Uh, eh, uh, no, but they're pretty shrunk. No thanks. What do those pennants say on them? Can't beat a Corley, they say. Kind of ironic, actually, considering how he died. Oof. Still, look great Dark on the bedroom wall. No walls. My bike is my own. We could set you up with a little pole so you could uh, make a flag, you know, for your back seat. I'll uh, think about it. Do you actually have any money? As much as I need. What's in the hat? I don't know. Came filled with it. Probably some sort of packing material. Packs a punch, I'll tell you that much. What's this big arena doing way out here? Corley built the Smashatorium so his employees could have some wholesome entertainment nearby. He sure took care of his employees. I got no idea what's gonna happen to us now that he's gone. Looky here, nothing personal, but why don't you mosey along and stop scaring away all the other customers, all right? Just clearing my throat. And it's cheap. No, I'm not putting my lips on that. 
What's a couple of bucks in exchange for a timeless memento? It's out of juice. These souvenirs all have an expected appreciation rate of 300 per- uh. Don't crowd everybody, there's enough for everyone. That's right, official Corley Motors Smashatorium Souvenir. I got a button under my toe that's wired directly into Corley Security's alarm system. Of course, I could be lying, but the question is... Do you feel lucky? Lately, no. Don't go away empty-handed. Come on, get- Alright, let's see the cash, amigo. I'll owe ya. No bucks, no yucks, compadre. All sizes and colors. These souvenirs all have an expected appreciation. No. Bye. It's a joystick. Probably for that little car. I'm not going in there. They all think I killed their beloved leader. These souvenirs all have an expected appreciation rate of 300% per year. We got your t-shirts here. Hmm. Nothing I can do out here. Actually. It's meant for... I'm saving yeah. that chain for my friends on the old... Don't want the power company after me too. It's meant for nuts. It's meant for nuts. Uh oh. Hmm. Am I stuck? Maybe. When his back is turned, grab the money. All right, let's try that. These souvenirs all have an expected appreciation rate of 300% per year. Fill our handy beverage hats with your drink of choice. You'll be keeping cold and looking bold. Don't crowd everybody, there's enough for everyone. <clears throat> hey, so Looky here. No worries. Nothing personal, but why don't Feel you mosey along and, and stop scaring away all the other through. customers, all right? Just clear As I throat. get lost and, and my memory fails too. me. <clears throat> Looky here. Nothing personal, but why don't you mosey along and stop scaring away all the other customers, all right? Just clearing my throat. Come on, give me a break. Lovable, lovable little bunny. All right, let's see the cash, amigo. Hallelujah. No bucks, no yucks, compadre. Official Corley Motors merchandise. Excuse me. Ah, good call. Are those shirts, um, are they all cotton? Well, uh, let's just see here. One hundred percent cotton. Oh, uh, that's too bad. I'm allergic to cotton. All right. Good we call. We got your hats. Our bunnies come with batteries included. Bunny won't do much there. That's oh, and right. then I gotta Official explode the bomb. Motors, and then I think I get the batteries. I 
think that's that's how this works. Ugh. I'm not putting my lips on that. I'm not putting my. been replanted. Tidy. You just can't get this stuff anywhere else, folks. We got your hats. We no. Don't crowd everybody. There's enough for everyone. That should put some life into it. Sure, sure. Take it for a spin. Just don't go out of range. Oh, I'm going out of range. Buy your kids a bunny so they'll shut up on the long drive home. Hey, don't go in there. Now look what you did. The entrance is all the way through the factory. Hang on, little buddy. Daddy's coming. Now it's just me and the bunnies. Time for some bunnies. <laughs> Alright, let's go blow up some bunnies, shall we? Exploding bunnies, more specifically. Okay. See the giveaway. As soon as we get past the bunnies, I will do the giveaway. This one's a bit of a timed. I hate surprises. They're not timed, but you, you get the point. Unless Steph is here. Is Steph here? She can do the giveaway. Off any of these boys. No. 
There we go. That's the guy was Okay. Before we get into that, let's do this giveaway real quick. Um Let's see. Let's see if this works. That is not, it's not a for a thousand hammers, but that's a good try. This doesn't work. This is kind of crazy, actually. Um. I didn't think it would only be 30 seconds. So let me let me do that again, just because we're testing things out here. Um, I will give Misty 100 hammers. And uh, we'll actually do this properly. The more you know, right? Uh, all right, let me give Misty her 100 points real quick for my fault. Actually, you know what? Yeah, 100 points. And then... Um, Sully! How's it going, bud? Uh, we're just trying to do this giveaway real quick. You stepped in perfect timing. But my bot decided to be ridiculous. So let's do this. Uh, ticket cost is zero, one. Let's do that. Uh, I'm good, man. I um, got my PlayStation. It arrived on time. Um, in fact, it's right here in all of its beautiful, massive glory. Um, but that's not why we're here. Still waiting. Wow. Well, your, your Xbox was a day, a day late too, right? All right, well, we're going to let that um, raffle run for a little bit, and we will get back in the game. I'm telling you about Susie. You sure? Yeah. That's the guy who killed my father. All right, vultures, rack them up. Let's rip them quick. Listen, Mo, you're making a big mistake. Oh, well, you're not. We shouldn't do this quickly. We should draw this out, don't you think, Susie? Have you, uh, has anyone, uh, I think Abbott's played this game before. Um, but has anybody ever played Full Throttle or any of the Lucas games? Ooh, Rocket League in 4K. Oh yeah, so Full, Full Throttle came out in like 96, so that makes sense. This is the remastered version, so it obviously looks a lot better. In fact, we found out uh, the last time when we were streaming that we can we can do this and make it look like we were in 1996. Uh, but we don't want that. Yes. Your father. Don't you dare talk about my father, you heartless bastard. Malcolm wants... I said shut up about my dad! 
Okay, that's enough. Mm, not quite. <clears throat> it was funny when I was a kid playing this, and I when I got to this part, I always thought like it, because the way that Sierra games um, kind of lead you, uh, there's always a death, like a death screen. And what I didn't understand as a kid was that Lucas Arts um, specifically didn't include a death sequence in any of their games. They didn't want to be like Sierra, so they wanted every. They, there was always, there's always a way to get past the puzzles. There's never a game over, and um, I was always kind of waiting for him to like get drawn and quartered quite literally. I'm losing my temper, Maureen. Hey, you're about to lose much more. Let me go or else... Or else what? I'll call you names. <laughs> like what? Diaper Dynamo. How? How'd you hear that name? Your father. He told me just before he died. You bludgeoned my father and then talked about old times? I didn't kill him. Rip Burger did. A photographer took pictures, but her camera was stolen by the same thug that came after you. I... I still have that role. Well, develop it, would you? While I still fit in my clothes... I gotta clothes. say, though, this game looks so hey. good. In the remastered state. Like, obviously, I remember it... I don't remember it looking like this, even when I was a kid. Sorry. It looked like a pixelated mess. Yeah. But well, this looks don't sweat fantastic. It. I'm gonna get rid did a very good even job. if I die trying. No. We have to expose Rip Burger at the shareholders' meeting. That way, we take him down, we save my gang, and your father gets his dying wish. You take over Corley Motors. Rip Burger canceled the shareholders' meeting. He made a statement to the press that there'd be no meeting until the murderers were brought to justice. So, no shareholders' meeting until we're both dead? Hmm. That could be arranged. Okay, so here we go. Faking Ben and Maureen's death. Act one, scene one. I love their Adrian outfits. Adrian Ripburger, in a desperate yeah, attempt to exactly. lure Maureen out of hiding, well, has so developed in, a following So, in her defense, you did call her a nickname scheme. that only First her father knew. So there had to be a little derby bit of is a vintage hard tail something. that Mo restored with her dad. Rip hopes Mo will try to nab said bike on account of her sentimental I'm sure you all saw. to it. So Ben but, and Mo uh, play along, put on Sully's birthday is in a couple days, and, and G Fuel decided derby. to boost his coupon code for uh, cars explode, thirty percent. Both are presumed dead. Uh, so make sure question. you order some G Fuel. Please save your questions until the end. Now the explosives in Mo's car can in only honor be triggered birthday. by a head-on collision with Ben's car. This ejector seat projects Mo clear of the explosion. And she perishes so to nice. safety. So nice. So thoughtful. Don't you think someone will notice her rejecting <laughs> out of her car? No. They'll all be watching you running around on fire. This is watermelon, yeah, by the way. That's and another it's question I have. When your car no, explodes, big, big fan. you climb from it in flames and run around the stadium distracting the audience. Although in I do wish there was a sour watermelon suit, of course. <laughs> flavor. That would be that's quite nice. Plan. All right, then. Let's go blow your little darlings up. All right, folks. Hang on to your chili dogs, cause it's time to start. The Corley Motors Smashatorium Amateur Driver Ultimate Destruction Maximum Carnage Marathon. Let's meet our crash cage gladiators. Okay, before we do that, let's jump over back to this uh, giveaway. All right, let's close the giveaway. And we will draw a winner in three, two, one. Mudcat, congratulations. You are the proud new owner of 100 hammers. With a 16.67% chance at winning. Fantastic. All right. That mysterious looking hooded figure wouldn't give us his real name. He prefers to be known as the Unknown Avenger. And a 
just fine with us. I like that um, in these old games they used to put George Lucas in all of their, uh, like in some capacity. Now so I'm that guy on the far left was. Uh, Who do they think they're fooling with those? Um, was a uh, homage to George. And next to him is another mass newcomer. Please give a big smashatorium salute to the princess of Pyla, Dory Schmorley. Yeah, Jesse, I'll get right on that. <laughs> Stream Elements was not my friend in that moment. And finally, we have a last-minute addition to the lineup tonight. A deadly-looking team known as the Boom Boom Brothers. Now, this is easily my Five, least seven, favorite now. part of this game. Um, right now, are you ready to see some reckless driving? You basically have to, like, start... Are you ready you to basically see have to kill yourself, quote unquote. Violent destruction? Then let the but, uh, Derby begin. What a nightmare. And it feels like a lift, like a jumping thing. Hang on, Mo. Here I come. Bounced off the roof. Looks like these babies have a glass jaw. Watch out for the Boom Boom Brothers, Mo. Cherry Poppins Raid! Hello, Raiders! What are you doing? Get over How's that, the um, that PS5 uh, setup go, uh, Maria? Ever get that audio issue sorted out? Speaking of which, I don't, uh, Sully, I don't know if you were in that, uh, in that stream, but, uh, apparently there's some weird HDMI issues with getting the audio all sorted out. Oh, you have to use the chat one. Okay. Yeah, there's. So yeah, Sully, when you get your PlayStation, there's going to be some weird audio problemos. Damn, I can't avoid these other cars forever. Yeah, on the PS5. Fancy Cherry was having some technical trucks. Abbott, do you remember how to do this? I don't recall how to... Oh, wait. apologize if this is a little loud, it's just I'm gonna get them into place so that I can bounce off their hood. I really don't recall how. You'll notice actually in the top, like right next to, like right there, that's a Max from Sam and Max. They always put him in, uh, in the LucasArts games.
CCP. Gotcha. That makes a lot of sense as to why you were having problems. Yeah, that was the first thing I noticed when I opened the box. Like, this controller is so solid. Like, I generally hate the PlayStation controllers, but it's fantastic. Um... I can't, yeah, we, if you donate $10, we can uh, spin the wheel. Um, I will, uh, I should have it open up on the other screen. Uh, if I don't, we can, we can do it on my phone, actually. Let's do that. Let's see. Since I'm having trouble with this, we'll do a quick thing. Emo with a party of 19! Go, go, raid! What's going on, raiders? Night Marauder, Fire Emblem Zack, thank you for the follows. How's it going, y'all? You having a good night? Who do we got in here? We got Emo, obviously, Midnight Twin, Gary's here, Misty's raiding. Thank you for the resub, Emo. Uh, I'm having some, some troubles remembering how to do this puzzle. And Mindy is going to donate some cash to Extra Life using my link. So I've got a thing that I've been doing where if you donate $10, um, I spin a wheel and you get a prize. I've got stickers. I've got some Funko Soda. Um, what else? What's fun stuff? I know, right, Gary? It's been like hours, days even. It's been like two and a half hours. Um, there's something else. Ozzy, thanks for the follow. I need to push her car up. Oh, the other car. That makes sense. Maybe we can get rid of this awful car noise. Yeah, P. King, those are phenomenal. Phenomenal uh, realism. Ladies and gentlemen, can't see any survivors. Wait, what's that? It's the unknown Avenger, and he's on fire. Let's give him a hand, folks. That looks painful. We really should put him out right away, but what a show, huh? He's the runner and the torch all in So, uh. If none of you have seen oh, what a 
um, this game before. Full Throttle is an old 90s um, LucasArts game. And uh, it came out in, I want to say like 95 or 96. This is the remastered edition, and it's now on Xbox Game Pass. That's the way out, but I can't get through that. Um, oh, right. Right along the sides. And uh, it's easily one of my favorite um, LucasArts games in this category. Or in the in their entire catalog. All right, Gary. I'll catch you later. Thanks for coming by with the uh, the raid. Appreciate it. Finally, now squish that firefly while he's hot. <laughs> Look at him run. No, like he's just like riding on the top of the car. Hey, Mindy with the five dollars. Once we uh, get out of here, we'll uh, get sp spinning wheel. Come on. Nope. Right. Hop on the top of the car. In the wheel of chance, Mindy. Mindy has a chance at winning a few different things. We have um, a few stickers that um, I have. So I'll, I'll go through those real quick. So we've got the original Nerds Unite. NASA logo that was designed by Ed Pogue in hollow. We've got a Ben and Gary's made in Canada salty and sweet sticker. Got the uh, limited, oh, these are all limited I should say. Well, the, uh, the Nerdy Night one I've got a few more of, but uh, Ben and Gary's and the, the new Lightning Ben Hammer sticker are very limited. I only have a handful of each. And then we have an assortment of soda. Um, uh, we, we, we know who's salty and who's sweet, Jesse. We just don't have to say it out loud. Um, we have a random assortment of uh, soda. Um, so we've got Ramona Flowers from ECCC. Uh, we've got a Fruit Brute, a Yummy Mummy, and a Funko Shop Freddy. 
So, I've got the wheel. Ah, oh, you probably won't be able to see that. But, let's see. We have the wheel here. So we will tap to spin. And the wheel says... A random steam code! Congratulations! So what I will do is I will send you a DM on Twitter and I will get you that code um, after we're done streaming. Gonna run right into a fire. What happened? Did you get him? We finally got him, Bolas. That means Ripburger has to make us vice presidents now, like he promised, and give us 10,000 shares of stock each. Hmm, funny smell. These guys are so, so dumb. Temperature light? Well, on the bright side. I just made 20,000 shares of stock. Time to start the shareholders. Hey, Christina. No, this is not Rocket League. This is... Where's the hard deal? Full throttle. All over the floor, One of my Mr. Avenger. Favorite LucasArts games. What happened to your deep sentimental attachment to your father's um, fitting Misty, bike? Ben, it's just you bike. crashed your stream, huh? Together in about I guess we'll never hour. find out That's again who is salty and who is sweet. That key. What key are you talking uh, about? Uh, Mindy, uh, let, we'll said. talk offline. I'll figure I something out for you. I he hit it somewhere on this bike, but I've looked everywhere and I can't find anything that even looks like a key. Uh, all right. I'll so see we need to I find a key. Right. In this massive. Hmm. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. 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 What's in the safe that's so important? My dad's will. I'm counting on him to tell the truth about me, finally. Why did he keep you a secret all these years? He didn't want people to find out about my mom. And if this was What's Rocket so League, I'd probably play it a lot more. She wasn't my mom. And uh. with the bits, thanks so much. Um... Yeah, no, if this was Rocket like if Rocket League was like 16-bit or whatever better this is, slightly better than 16-bit, I would play Rocket League all day long. What are we in, anyway? It's a C-330 Big Mouth Industrial Cargo Jumbo Transport we fixed up. We want to get it rolling so we can take it to biker rallies. You're going to try to fly this thing? Rolling, Ben. Rolling. This baby's flying days are over, just like mine. I'll see what I can do. Right. All right. We gotta find that code. Hmm. 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 Uh, no. I'll see what I can do. Right. Hmm. 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 A lot of codes here. Let me let me do a picture of this. I don't know if I have to write anything down, but you never know. These old games, they make you do all sorts of crazy things. Hmm. 
Here, take the photos. I don't want them. Show them to someone important if you get a chance. Okay. Can I go in here yet? Yes. Furniture moving? No. All right. Let's see. Code, code, code. Let's try. Hey, it worked. There's uh, some sort of card. A tape. I sure hope that's Corley's will. It's open. Very austere. No. Alright, let's go talk to Maureen. I, I don't walk. Yeah, yeah, get on your bike. Let's go. for me interesting all right back we go that would be interesting oh i should have tried it when we were there to do jingle bells with those ones but let's just keep on trucking along i say truck but we're on bikes uh oh Hard. Hard. Cool. Looks like the meeting started. Was not only an inspirational leader, but also a great personal friend. His loss affects us all deeply. And yes, that is Mark Hamill. Malcolm and I spoke often of the future. We talked of a day when Corley Motors would move beyond its humble beginnings into a new vehicular age. And although his tragic death took him from us sooner than anyone expected, Malcolm Corley's dream remains. And I shall carry out that dream in his memory. Sure you will, pal. Ladies and gentlemen, I am pleased to present to you the future of Corley Motors. The Corley Minivan. It's so hideous. <laughs> Corley was right. I never dreamed it would actually come to minivans, though. is going on up there i'm on it just readjusting the lamp and motor controls here yeah uh, uh, yes sorry about that i hate this old equipment my girdle needs less adjusting man that rip burger can yap where does he get this crap hey who are you how long have you been there? Oh, security! Help! Security! Yes, the evil plan is what a took minivan. What so long? He ran down the hallway. Move it. Because to a biker company. Mavis must be saying things. What's worse than not making bikes? Making minivans. Furniture moving? No. Very austere. No drawers. 
I think it's the... What you see before you there right now is my vision for you. Oh, perfect. This is a disaster. Oh, yeah, for sure. Diversity of products, great idea. I have some major downtime here. But uh, Corley would have never gone for it, which is why he had to murder him. I, I don't know any jokes. <laughs> you know, this reminds me of an amusing anecdote. <laughs> About her... Uh, uh, I... And the majority of the shareholders, as well, well as all of their customers buy bikes. Okay. Now, this next slide shows our new, more aggressive corporate strategy. If you're hearing this, I must have croaked. Well, people gotta move on, you know, and make room for other people. And that's what I'm here to talk about today. I've made room for someone else to take my place at Corley Motors. And it ain't that embezzling crook, Adrian Ripper. Rip, you don't belong at the head of my company. You belong in jail. Can you imagine a corporate shareholder uh, meeting man talk me <laughs> where they miss something like this happen? Like it would be so good. He was wrong. I was wrong. I should have stood by him. I hope, Maureen, that you forgive me and that you take over Corley Motors and run it however you see fit. All right, that's enough. How do I turn this damn thing off? I... Uh, I'm sorry you had to hear that tape from... One of Malcolm's psychiatric sessions. And near the end, he, he suffered many paranoid delusions. He was haunted by powerful forces of his own creation. And here's one of them. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Maureen Corley, and do I have a heck of a story for you. By the time I'm done, you'll see why this man should be in jail. Hey! Off too. Uh oh. There he goes. And then he sent his goons after me. I mean, it's not a rock solid plan. When it's time to find, especially you, since he got caught. The shiny trail. Yes, of course we'll have daycare facilities. Any other questions? Oh, speak of the devil. Come over here, Ben. That is great, Ben. I find the love we were meant to be all alone. So, 
After we pick up your bike, Curious Raid! We'll my gang out Rage, of jail. Priscilla, and how are things? And why my gang never showed up to help us. And then you go business suit shopping. Don't remind me. Don't complain. You're going to be rich. Jumps! At this point, I'd settle for just a little peace and quiet. Just when you thought they were going to ride off into the sunset? Mark Hamill's got plans for you. Curious movie. Oh, I don't know if you remember this, but it's not like. It's like ridiculous. Oh, apparently he's got a gun. that totally would work in real life. This is why I say it's like Fast and the Furious. something if I touched it it would fall off I mean the fact that it's on there to begin with is pretty impressive Oh, 
one sneaks up on me from behind. All right. Into the giant cargo plane. And the truck, of course, has a machine gun turret. I'm telling you, Sally, this is like the plot of three Fast and Furious movies. I thought you said this thing couldn't move. I said it couldn't fly. I never said it couldn't taxi. Well, flying would be nice since we're headed for the gorge. Ripburger, you're going to kill all of us. Shh, Ben, don't ruin the movie. How do you stop this thing? From the cockpit! Hey, Vile Malpert, how's it going? Doc! Careful, Ben! So much for the controls. I could have used those. Damn. Hmm. Busted. Those might have been useful. Ah, there we go. All right, let's see here. Take off. Cargo. Nope. Take off. Retake off. Engine. Nope. In flight, autopilot. Hey, Andrea, how's it going? Here goes nothing. All right. What the? Ben, what did you do? Oh, Vile Melper, thank you for the follow. <laughs> Sully, come on, man. Tell me this isn't like Fast and the Furious ben, or Uncharted ben, or both. Are you alive? I am. It totally but is. I don't know about Rip Burger. I can see him. He's out cold. Climb back here quick. How is your uh, stream, Rach? Machine gun, machine guns, control, off. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Get a good run. Well, the answer's there. Reach that. Mm, let me try that again. Oh, yeah. All right, let's do that again. Yeah, ben, we're we're almost ben. at the. Uh, Climb back here quick. Almost the. I, I didn't die. There's no death in this, but close enough. Um. All right. Menu, defense, machine guns, control, off. It's okay, I got it. We got there. Alright, bud. Try that again. Yeah, I wonder if we're not supposed to murder Red Burger as much as we want to. I don't recall. 
pretty sure ben, we're supposed to, though. Ben! Climb back here, quick! Uh, main menu. Freight. No. Engine. Or, nope, that definitely is the wrong one. Like 99% sure I have to remove those turrets and he dies. No. Let me try that again. Yeah, there's something I'm missing. I wonder if I have to... Ben! Ben! Climb back here, quick! Main menu. Great. Wait. Temperature. Vital signs. Nope. Just did that again. Wow. <laughs> yes, it's exactly like Wayne's World with all the endings. Except we only need the one, and we're not getting there. <clears throat> Let me try that again. Ben! Ben! Climb back here, quick! Alright. Do the turrets. Of course it was. I mean, all in all, the game isn't super long. Um, yeah. Defense machines. Oh, maybe if you go back in, it kills you. Rather than doing this Fast and the Furious escape. Yeah. Wait, right, come cool. back! We need your weight in the plane! see Fast and Furious with motorbikes. This would be so great. I mean, I guess we kind of did. But... Life was a game to him. And he played it by his own rules. He was a mystery to most of us. And yet, an inspiration to us all. He gave us freedom. He gave us power. He gave us wings. I know. I'm pretty he sure I killed wings. several of them. Thank you, Malcolm Corley, for giving us a dream. Maybe they were just we'll never slightly die. injured. So, <laughs> sunward. So, uh, maybe we could do lunch sometime next Yeah, week. Torque is pretty good. Yeah, sure. Lunch sounds great. Things aren't gonna Very change, diplomatic. Are they, Ben. I mean, just because I'm in charge of the company now and living in a mansion and riding around in limos, that doesn't mean we won't spend a lot of time together, does it? Look, Mo, you're in a different league now. You shouldn't be hanging out with the likes of me anymore. But, Ben. Oh, just a second. Hello? What? No, 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 that's crazy. Is he nuts? 
Look, move the meeting up to five and tell the plant foreman that I'm coming over personally to inspect those parts. I know, I know, that's what I told him. <sighs> Excuse me, what was that last part? No, 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 that alloy was flawed to begin with. Uh-huh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she did it. She did a great. great job of like just jumping in, taking over the company. I like that addition. In memory of Roy Conrad, he was the voice of Ben. I love this game so much. Not super long. It's got a great story and great characters. Phenomenal music. I actually still have it on my playlist on the on Apple Music. Such a great, great soundtrack and game and just everything. These old point and click games, you really just can't. They've, there's been a few that have tried. Um, like Thimbleweed Park was written and created by a few of these old Lucas Games guys, but they're just so good. I like that his name is Ben Throttle. That's great. And Bill Farm, Bill Farm, wasn't that the voice of Goofy? I'm pretty sure that's the voice of Goofy. And then Maurice LaMarche is um, his brain from Pinky and the Brain. Oh, good. He did a bunch of voices. I don't... Denny Delk? And the voice of Susie Trust McNeil. She does the voice of... Um, Dot from Animaniacs. And Steve Blum is, uh, he does like tons of voices. He's done like Wolverine and Spike from Cowboy Bebop, a bunch of other stuff. All right, we got 28 viewers. Let me uh, switch screens here, so that's gonna freeze for a second. Let's do a quick giveaway here. A hundred hammers. Oh, me too, Sunward. It's probably my favorite. Um, my favorite anime.
All right, so if you hit uh, exclamation point ticket and uh, you get entered to win uh, some hammers, which is my uh, my channel currency. Titan AE is, no, I love Titan AE. I want pops of Titan AE. Ooh. But yeah, actually I'm wearing a Cowboy Bebop shirt. Kind of fitting. I would love if they made the uh, pops of the old, these old Lucas games. Guybrush, Threepwood, the Tentacles from Day of the Tentacle and Maniac Mansion. Salmon Max. Actually, there's a studio called, um, I think it's called Boss Fight, and they're releasing like full scale sized um, Salmon Max figures. I was gonna go. They've, they've been pre selling them for a while, and they're all sold out right now. They're pre sale. Uh, but once they go back in stock, I gotta grab those up. Oh, nice. I gotta check that out. I love Dom Blues. Titan E did not get enough. Uh, highly underrated movie. And uh, in fact, I actually watched. I watched Land Before Time 1 last night. I was. Uh, feeling kind of nostalgic. I'd forgotten that it was only an hour long. Um, I gotta watch Titan AE again, though. It's a great movie. We'll uh, let that giveaway run for a little longer. Uh, if you haven't already, just hit exclamation point ticket. Get your ticket in for some hammer points. And, um, and then we'll find somebody to raid. Oh yeah, I've, I've watched Titan E probably once every, I want to say, five years. I've seen it recently, just not recently enough. Well, that's super rude that Titan AE isn't streaming anywhere. It's streaming in Canada. An app called Just Watch. I highly recommend if you don't use it. Titan um, is not available. Hmm. But it's like $5 on Apple TV and Amazon Prime to purchase. Might end up doing that. You know, I don't think I've seen Land Before Time since I was like six years old. Or whenever that movie came out. I think it was 89. So yeah, I would have been like five. Um, but uh, yeah, it's a, it's a movie that, uh, that happened. Probably didn't. I, I probably haven't watched it enough to really truly appreciate it after all this time. Oh yeah, Just Watch is the best. Um, best app, like free. Searches every platform you already own. It's great. Um, Jesse, yeah, yeah, we beat it. We're done. We gotta watch the credits though. And and hopefully not get a uh, DMCA hit on my stream. Although I, I I didn't check the VOD from my last stream to see if they um, if they muted any of the music. I'm sure they did. But you never know. It's so hard to tell.
I also don't remember if there's anything after the credits. I feel like some of these games had more stuff. It was like the start of the post credit sequence. Agreed. They all deserve their credit. And we're going to thank the following cats. Because the cats are important. We got Chuck and Dandelion, Eartha and Pumpkin, Frida and Indy and Hobbs, Monkey, Trouble, Smidgen, and Whisper. Tim would like to thank no cats and does not endorse cat ownership. Wow. Well done. Biker haikus. Bar fighters leap out, moths tangle with orange hot flame, my nose thrice broken. Splitting lanes at Rush Beamer tries for a cutoff, taste my righteous chain. Booming thunder rolls, clutch, release throttle open, red smear on pavement roof. Wet grease on the road makes me laugh as my buddy slides under a truck. On the road for days, two wheels, an engine, and me, I don't brush my teeth. Well, that's probably true. Sky covers the land, dark goggles cover my face, speed covers my tracks. Al Barwood has actually, uh, he worked on um, Indiana Jones uh, in The Fate of Atlantis. Emmett drops a load, green crap pokes the road like snow. Just take a little. Oh man, these are fantastic. I thank the Lord each day. Within the asphalt, hot leather, shiny metal. See, I'm manly. My male fantasy, now a profit making game. Maybe I'll get chicks. Phenomenal. Phenomenal. The end. Man, I missed that logo. I was right. Here come the bunnies. Well, they only blew up because they were running into a landmine. So these ones are just hopping around. So no. Unless they find a landmine somewhere in the middle of the open road. All right. Um, now, the a cool thing with this game um, is uh, there's some bonuses. So they've got concept art jukebox, and audio commentary. Let's check out this. Um, let's check out this concept art. I would love a book with this type of art. Look at like Ben's old, like original design. He almost looks Elvis-like. I much prefer his new look. Lots of... Oh, and then the design of the building and the logos. Uh, like a real kickstand bar? I'm not too sure. Be pretty cool if there was. It looks so different. Wow. I'm I'm glad he doesn't look like this now. Like I'm glad that this didn't get. Oh, you can almost see that they uh, they may have used his original drawings to to model a rip burger
kind of reminds me of um oh what's his name stan from monkey island the the salesman he had the similar kind of grin and then you've got almost got the um, um uh yeah, Ash versus Evil Dead for sure. And then we're getting into more of the like what actually occurred. They were stuck on that long face for a while though. Until they eventually went to a more wider kind of gruffer biker look just gonna kind of rip through these there's the over map for the first section oh that's interesting this wasn't oh this is the whole map actually Google Maps says there's a kickstand barn grill in Rock Hill, South Carolina. Oh, all right. road trip. Let's go. Movie after COVID. This is really neat, though. The uh, full map. We've got a ranch out here, the Mink Ranch. Uh, train tracks and the kickstands up here. Got the gorge. Orly Factory. Test site. A cavefish hideout. Which we only really saw a small portion of. Got some... All sorts of modern... Kind of futuristic. Oh, and then we've got Mo's shop. I never noticed. I, I wonder if in the full game that it says Mo on the door. I never even bothered to look. Kickstand, gambling slots, the best drink saloon in town. <laughs> I like that they blurred the phone number, that's great. Rotwheeler flipping the bird, as he should. Lose the big wheel. Well, yeah, because it's a plane. It'd be funny, actually, if the... I made the jokes of the Fast and Furious earlier, but I wonder, I wonder if they they took the idea. That would have been funnier. Oh, man, the adventurer. I used to get this magazine. Like a little digest-sized magazine that talked about Lucas stuff. So oh, cool. Tons of art. Tell, I would love a LucasArts complete, like, all the games. Um, all right. So, let's end this giveaway. We'll draw a winner, and then we will go find a raid. Funko Level 30. Mindy, congratulations. Get you those points. Here's a result from Pinterest. No, I don't want 
anything from Pinterest. Thank you, though. Let's send those points over. Let's take a look and raid a channel. We've got Boston and Ryan Shang. Let's go raid Asian Tony Stark. Thanks, everybody, for hanging out uh, on my nostalgia-fueled trip. Um, I will be back Saturday afternoon with hopefully some PS5 uh, gaming. Or maybe we'll play another LucasArts game. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Let's uh, let's get ready to read these guys.